What is happening everybody, Macboy here from Macboy Productions. Today I'm going to show you how to make any image you want into a brush in Photoshop CS5. Now the very first thing you need is an image to make into a brush. And of course, the answer to all your image problems is Google. So go ahead, find an image in Google, preferably a PNG, because you want the background to be transparent for maximum results. Once you have, open it up in Photoshop. In my case, I just got the icon of Firefox and open it up in Photoshop. As you can see, it is a PNG because the background is transparent. Now from here, what you can do is go ahead and click on the selection tool and select an area of this image to make it into a brush or you can just hit Command A on your keyboard which will highlight everything in the document. And whatever you highlight in this image will be transformed into a brush. And honestly, ladies and gentlemen, this will take you not more than 10 seconds. Once you have highlighted your area, all you have to do is go up to Edit and click on Define Brush Preset. Here you can name your brush whatever you want. In my case, I would name it Firefox. Hit Enter, and there you have it. If you hit the B key on your keyboard, you will select your brush tool, go up to your brush selection, and select your last one, which should be the image you just created. Click on it, and there you have it. Now. To demonstrate, let me open up a new document for you, plain white, and all I gotta do is click. As you can see, the Firefox logo is now imprinted on that document in blue. Now the only problem with this technique is you can only select one color at a time. But on the good side is you can make cool effects by adding different colors from different shapes. For example, if I've already placed a blue Firefox there and I change my foreground color to red, add a new layer, and then slightly Beside the original one, I place another one and play around with the opacity and the arrangement of these and you can get a cool looking 3D effect. Put on your 3D glasses and I'm sure that fox will jump right out of your screen. Get it because it looks 3D and that's fire... F never mind. Anyway, thanks a lot for watching guys. I hope you liked this video and if you did, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to these videos and channel. One more thing guys, don't forget the links down below in the sidebar, the bottom bar, whatever you want to call it. And I'll see every single one of you in the next one.